I just want to continue to, on to say that um, past tense, I had not developed, began to develop a relationship with God, at least in the form of reading a devotional and scriptures, until I had uh, embarked on a 40-day fast from the computer in which I had a men's devotional Bible that a, a dear Christian brother had given me when I was living in Texas. And it had some great um, devotions in it. Of course, I look back in retrospect and see that those devotionals were good for me for one season, but they came to the point where they were not good for me for the next season that God was bringing me into. I'm at a point right now, just in my own personal life, where I'm no longer reading a traditional devotional. I may get a book by a brother in Christ who uh, expounds on some Greek words, original Greek and Hebrew definitions. I'm embarking to find out more about the Bible. Having the Holy Spirit to illuminate the Scripture, make it alive to me. Let the words leap out the, jump off the pages and let it be as though as if I were reading it for the first time. Letting it truly become experiential. There are some of you, and I kind of want to bring this to a close here now, who feel that you do not know God and maybe you're, you've been angry at God. I know what it's like to be angry at God. In fact, I know what it's, what it's like to even hate God. When I was entangled with lust of sin, sexual sin especially. And again, I'm not, a, I'm not ashamed, I'm not afraid to share this story. Because Christ has set me free. If you desire to have a relationship with God, Pray this prayer. Lord Jesus, I confess to you right now that I'm a sinner in need of a Savior. Give me the grace to repent of my sins through changing my thinking. I worship you, Lord. I praise you, Lord Jesus. I desire to have a relationship with you where I can talk to you and just have a conversation. Show me what it means, O oh God, to worship you in spirit and in truth. If you pray that prayer, then you can confess that you're saved. By saying, I receive you, Christ, into my heart as Lord and Savior. God has called me to be an evangelist on YouTube. Starting out my ministry by preaching the word on YouTube. And by God's leading and by His grace, there will be other doors of opportunity that will open up for me. In which I will have the opportunity to uh, get my feet wet and my hands dirty. So be blessed, and don't be stressed, but worship the best, who is Yeshua HaMashiach, the mighty one of Israel, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Shalom, and peace be with you. Amen.